Ace money to name, getting paid for the game. My goal is to help you get that money by sharing my picks, as well as some useful knowledge and betting techniques. Now, while we go over this recap, I'd like to get right into these picks so we can get in and out like a B&E with handicappers. So it's a SBR, Sportsbook Robbery. Here, uh, it's almost two o'clock Sunday. Game's about to start. Sorry, I had some family things going on. All right, first I got Dante Divincenzo. First quarter rebounds over one and a half. Good plus money, one thirty six. Gone over this last two games. Knicks are gonna have to be aggressive. Uh, he's like Tega. He's got good hops. Believe he should go over this. Being aggressive, uh, half units first uh, first quarter props. Then I'm gonna jump right into his next play. Got him on three points over three and a half at plus one twenty. Now I'm a Knicks fan. I believe the Knicks are gonna win. He's had some off games, but if he's gonna if they're gonna win. Or if he's going to have an on game, which I believe he will, he's going to go over this. He's going to have about five threes. So, uh, yeah, I got Dante over three and a half threes and over one and a half first quarter rebounds. Threes. Minus 110 on FanDuel. I played it on DraftKings. I think minus 115. Three last game, you know, it's either hit or miss with this. Uh, he's going to need a big game playing at home. I believe he's going to go over it. Shooting about 33% from three. Eight attempts last game. Uh, I think Knicks are going to pull it out at home with the energy behind them in the garden. And uh, he's going to go over this. He's going to have a 40-point night. I also played him over one and a half first quarter rebounds. At, it was like plus 200. Right now, they don't have it on there. You might be able to find it if you want to play that as well, half unit. Uh, usually, that's hit or miss. But uh, give it a whirl today. So, I got Brunson. Over two and a half threes, and then I played his his first quarter uh, rebounds. They don't have it on right now. Line shot. I placed it on DraftKings a little earlier. It's gone over there. It's four out of the last five. Um, he hasn't been scoring that much, but he's been running the point. Top of the key there, just dropping dimes, real good passes. I believe in the goal of this. Um, he's been doing really well. <clears throat> they gave a little tidbit the other day saying how his dad, when he used to coach him or train him, he'd make him go a whole quarter without trying to score, so he'd work on his other attributes. And, uh, he got really good at passing and stuff, but they're going to need him on that point and just drop off to the back cutters and stuff. So I got Hartenstein with four and a half assists plus money. Turn them notifications on. I drop a lot of live plays so you get them instantly before the, the odds change and the numbers change. As well as uh, I'm going to have a giveaway when I get to 500 subscribers. Uh, $100 giveaway. So uh, if you subscribe, you'll, you'll be entered into that. All right. We got uh, McBride over one and a half threes. Uh, he's been in the starting lineup, getting more minutes. He's easily been going over this. He's got a nice shot. When he's on, he's on. Um, OG might come back today. He probably will. They haven't released it yet. It's an hour before game time right now. But even if he does and McBride comes off the bench, he's uh he's gonna go over this. He shoots mostly threes. 
But uh, if he starts, he's definitely going over this. So we got McBride, Miles McBride, a.k.a. Deuce, over one and a half threes. I'm also playing this Josh Hart over 11 and a half points, plus 120. Uh, I played at plus 115, DraftKings, they got it at plus 118 on FanDuel. They don't have ESPN bet in New York. He hurt his abdomen last game. Obviously, you see his last four games, he's been on and off. They're going to need him to play. He's going to have to be aggressive trying to score. Uh, if he's good enough to play, I believe he'll go over this. He's going to have to push the pace and uh, get some baskets. He might shoot some threes if if he's hurting so he don't have to drive. But uh, Knicks need all their players to play. They're going to play. He's going to go over this. So I got Josh Hart over 11 and a half points. Go New York. Go New York. Go. Is uh, WNBA, it's a 3 o'clock game, Seattle at Washington. I got Jewel Lloyd over 4.5 rebounds. They don't have these plays all over. Right now it's on DraftKings, minus 120. It's been two games so far. They're 0-2, but uh, she had six last game, 10 the game before. I believe they should go over this. I'm going to start having WNBA uh, videos definitely value in them they don't even update these during the game do live betting or anything they don't really have people on them so you, you might not be able to find a lot of plays but the ones you find are good ones so i'm gonna start dropping them i think they're gonna go really well uh plus the girls hustle they, they play they put their all in they're not like these these men plus the season's half as long they got no no choice but to try. So, Jewel Lloyd, over four and a half rebounds. I uh, appreciate everybody. Ace Money, the name, getting paid for the game. I'm going to try to get this out. Sorry it's so late. Uh -huh.